Yo, what's up you guys? This is Godson. I'm back and I have a quick wish list that I want to share with you guys if you are in the same boat as me and you're waiting for this update. I guess I will I want to just go through some stuff that I would like to see in this update. Now I'm not sure exactly when it's coming out. Some people have speculated and it's rumored maybe towards the end of this month or possibly next month. Uh, but you know what? Either way, I'm pretty sure this is going to be uh, maybe a bigger update because uh, we've the last one we only had uh, you know just the Christmas patch and a new Inferno Tower so I'm sure we might get something better uh, a little bit more on this update so let me go and show you guys what uh, what my wish list is for this update if uh, you guys agree with this let me know and share it down in the comment box which you feel uh, is gonna be in the update but these are my six things that I would like to see in the new update uh, number one, I would like to see the uh, Inferno Tower changes because right now as it is, if you're using the multi settings for the Inferno Towers and uh, for example, if you have a golem that is attacking your base and it's just the golem, no nothing else, it'll take a long time for that Inferno Tower to kill it if it's on multi. And what's wrong with this is if it stays on the golem for, you know, I don't know how many seconds, eventually it's gonna run out of juice and the juice is just like how it would be on a single uh, setting so I feel you know what they could do is they could change it so that it doesn't use as much dark elixir when it's taking out the golem especially if it's on a uh, if it only has one target and it's set on multi so that's just the one thing that I would like to see changed if they could uh, lower the amount of dark elixir it uses for multi especially if it's only targeting one target. My second thing I would like to see is uh, new dark troops. I think the last one we saw was the witch and that was a few months ago. Now that was actually a really good troop and it was somewhat game breaking when it first came out but they balanced it and now it's not as bad. So I, I like the witch a lot but I would like to see maybe more dark troops because uh, I think uh, we just have a lot of slots left that we could fill in. And that's always a, a really a really cool thing to have new troops coming out. I think that's what brings a lot of people to check out the game. So just dark troops. I would like to see more of those. And uh, the third one I would like to see is maybe a campaign expansion. I, I really like campaign. I haven't played every single level, but I think it's a good way to get more money in the game if you're just waiting around and you have a shield on. So I think campaign levels are good and I actually heard it, it might be rumored that uh, some of these new campaigns if they bring it out will have dark elixir and possibly ways you can earn gems in the campaigns. So I would think that would be a good thing if you could do that. If Supercell adds that feature that would be great. Uh, the next thing I would like to see is, uh, is a new hero. Now what I like about Supercell is they've made characters of every character that they've drawn that they've animated onto a picture. Uh, it seems like every single character has been made except for one if you guys know who it is. And it's the uh, Goblin King. I've tried asking a lot. <laughs> People are probably getting tired of me asking for this but I really just want to see him in the game. They can have him as a boss at the end of a, of a campaign. You know, if they add an expansion to the campaign, he could be the boss at the end. And even maybe a playable character. I just really think it would be awesome to have him as like a sub-hero, you know, uh, or anti-hero. anti, anti -hero. I, I'm not sure what exactly they could do with it, but I just like the goblin. And, you know, it just makes sense to actually make the character as a boss even, you know, just, just to have more variety in the game. Uh, another thing I would like to see is Endless Waves. Uh, if you have played other games that are kind of like Clash of Clans, uh, some of them actually have this feature called Endless Waves. And what that is is basically your town is defending itself against AI units that are continually attacking. And you go through, you know, wave one, two, three, and you keep going until your base is pretty much, you know, exhausted and it can't fight anymore. I think that would be a really cool feature to have, especially, you know, since we have YouTube now, we could record how many waves that someone has gotten up to. And I think that would just be a really cool feature if Superstar Allen added that. Just have like an endless wave mode where you're defending your base. And the last thing I would like to see you guys is Clan Wars. Now, it's been rumored a lot. Uh, 
I think I've seen, I've, I've heard a lot of people saying that it should be in this new update. I'm not sure if it will be in this new update. Uh, I know they said it's their number one priority right now, but if they're going to do Clan Wars, maybe they could have it so that uh, the arena in which clans fight could be a default arena. Basically meaning uh, if someone that is a lower rank is going to fight someone that is a higher rank, they could have it like a level playing field where we both get the same types of troops that are the same level and maybe even have a pre-made base for us to attack from each other. It's a lot of things that they could do. I'm excited to see what exactly they're going to do with Clan Wars. If somehow they can make it balanced enough for everyone to, to play it and not just have, you know, the top players or the highest, strongest players always dominating against other players. They should hopefully make it so that any lower player or higher player could fight each other and just have it balanced. So you guys, those are my, that's my wish list for this new update. Again, I'm not sure exactly when it's coming out. It's been rumored maybe the end of this month to next month, but we will see. So thank you guys for checking out this video. Please write in the comments what you feel will be in the next update and hopefully we will see it, you guys. So again, thanks for watching, stay tuned, and I'll see you next time.